welcome to today's vlog. We're just south of Washington, battling all these highways, 270, 495. It's fun. So, Roz, we're going 18 miles looking for exit 38 to 270 north. We'll be home in about 5 hours and 50 minutes. Alright boys, we're on the 270 right now in between Baltimore and Washington and Maryland now. EMC uh, Squared. EMC Squared, yeah. It's, uh, it's probably cold and it's been raining, misting all morning, but I think we're supposed to be driving out of that. So, we'll keep you posted. We're looking at uh, friggin' five and a half hours still, 324 miles total. We got a S7 and a C63 AMG playing cat and mouse up there. They are racist, boy. Uh, oh my god. Okay, so two minutes after the uh, C63 and the A7 or S7 go by. Oh, all right, it's not them, it's a deer. Somebody hit a deer. Looks like CRV maybe. Roz, as soon as you get past these cars, I don't know, but I'm not going to cop And the Lexus. Yeah. I don't know who hit the deer. Pennsylvania. Four hours left. Oh, boys, we've made it to Breezewood, Pennsylvania. Three hours and 40 minutes to go, 220 miles. Uh, this is the little town where. It ends, 70 ends, and then you get on 70 again. You have to go through Breezewood. It's pretty much gas stations, truck stops, Taco Hill, probably a hotel. Yeah, turnpike. You're doing well. Uh, yeah, Somerset. Somerset. However, that said, you're at the Allegheny Tunnel. It's always exciting. It's getting real foggy. We're uh, far past the tunnel now, closer to Pittsburgh, I think. It is very foggy. You can see cars on the road, fine, but that's pretty much it. We found it's an S5. All right, I thought I thought it was the S7 that was flying before. That's an S5 though. Welcome to Ohio. Damn it. Welcome home. All right. So the original ETA was 5:30. We got home a little before that. It's now actually about 5:30. I have completely unpacked everything, um, put all the tech stuff away, organized all of my stuff, and I'm back. And it's still here, and I don't have any flat tires. At least that I can see right now. So I guess that's good. So I don't really know what's going on tonight. I totally cleared out the Watch Later playlist and my emails yesterday, which is fantastic. Um, I will probably have to do that again tonight. I have Christmas stuff that needs to be taken down outside here, although it's too cold right now. Tomorrow's supposed to be up around 50, actually, so I think I'll do it then. There's quite a bit of snow here. I haven't seen snow for a week, so we saw a tiny bit uh, on the way here. And then pretty much once we got to Northeastern Ohio, here it is, there's probably three inches. It's all slush on top of the yard and uh, some on the driveway, but the roads are just wet and a little salty. So it's sat now for, since the 31st, I wanna say. The 31st was the day that uh, I washed it backed it into the corner, and decided it was gonna sit. So it has not been locked, unlocked, touched, started, driven, otherwise used this year. And it's only the 10th day of the year. But we had temperatures here, the wind chill was about negative 40. I think I saw negative 42 is our lowest wind chill. And the lowest actual temperature was about negative 12, negative 14, somewhere in there. So I don't know what it got down to in the garage. Knowing them, they probably left the door open some of the time and it got down to near that cold. Right now it's not bad. It's 32 outside and just over 40 inside. 
So um, let's see what an OEM battery of over a year does. That's a flashing light for the security, so that's good news. That's good news. That's good news. Door feels like it was opened yesterday. Mm, smells good and the lights are bright and the M thing comes on. So I'm gonna push it forward so when it does start, I won't make that wall any more black than it already is. All right, tires are frozen to the cement. I can't budge it. So it's not even making noises. So I guess I'm gonna duct tape some freaking paper towels over the tips. All right, this should do. That's really half-assed, but that should do. I've left the doors open during most of my time doing this too, so that's not exactly gonna help me, but hopefully it don't hurt me. We have lights. Admittedly, it did crank a little slower than usual, and I heard a little bit of noise from the uh, paper towels back there fluffing together. But I'm gonna let it run for a minute. Maybe we'll. Oh, let's let's listen to the uh, tires break free from the from the cement. Didn't make that much of a noise, but it felt like I was going up a pretty steep hill. Well, guys, hello. The, uh, it's now like 1.15 p.m. the next day. I fell asleep very early last night. I apologize for that. We didn't even get a vlog up. It's 52 degrees, windy, and rainy out here. But, uh, it's snow melting. Look at that. That's snow right there. How disgusting is that? And yes, I parked this far away from the store, backed into a spot along with a Lexus ES looks like, and an Impala out there. Dickered, dickered. So uh, I'm gonna end this vlog now and start tomorrow's now. So I'm sorry this is so late. Good night, good morning, afternoon, whatever the hell it is.